say that, you know, Nina was in a there, there was a lot of people in Germany at that time. German Germany actually had a little bit of a renaissance in music during the mm. um, late 70s to mid 80s and, yeah. because they had Falco. So Falco had had a number one song two years after uh, Nina did with Rock Me Amadeus, oh, yeah, which yeah. again was all in German. Um, a great song. There were groups that were, I mean, a lot of them have this whole, they were very techno driven. Craft work. Craft, yeah, huge. Well ahead of their time. And a huge influence on uh, musicians, like especially Mm -hmm. new wave, new wave and new age musicians. And then on hip hop, strangely enough, it was like, they were strangely popular among certain hip hop people. Planet Rock by Africa Bombata, which is one of the seminal, you know, rap pieces in, you know, in, in music history. That was a that was him stitching together to Kraftwerk songs uh, for the music. So yeah, I mean everybody sampled of Kraftwerk at that time in, in the hip hop world. Not what you would expect, but it's kind of cool to see that history. But there was a very, very uh, a thriving scene in Germany for like new wave music. Mm-hmm. You know, it's kind of strange to our ears, strange music. But over there, it was like it was we, very popular. We were talking about a. a it wasn't a big hit here in the United States, but people would know it called uh, Da 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 by Trio. Right, right. and they, some people may know it because it was in a, a Volkswagen ad. Yes, that's right. Yeah, that's how it so, got more famous. Yeah. Correct. Da, da, da. Da, da, da. Um, so yeah, so anyway, there was a lot of, of, you know, a lot of people say that bad times really create good art. And I think that's kind of what was going on in Germany at that time. Hey, if you like what you hear, like and subscribe. It really means a lot. And we would love to have you coming back every week. Thank you.